and welcome back on this Monday morning. So we are in for a stretch of very nice conditions as far as what it was going to feel like outside. We are in a more comfortable, a more pleasant air mass that is going to stick around with us for the rest of this week, extending into this weekend. Temperatures will be remaining on the cooler side to seasonal ranges. Now, as far as precipitation, there is a chance across the southern counties later on today, but we're really kind of looking ahead at a potential of a system that will bring in more rain and some thunderstorms between Thursday extending into Friday. So we're a couple days away from that, but here's how it looks out there right now. This is the air mass that we have in place. Current dew point temperatures are in the 50s across the UP. Those low 70s that we had last week and the end of last week now, mainly in southern Wisconsin and for areas downstate. So we are in a more comfortable air mass that sticks around for a while. Here's what's happening at the surface. There is this frontal boundary that's tracking right across the central areas, areas of the lower peninsula and into Wisconsin. So this actually stays south of the UP, but along that frontal boundary, that's where there's going to be a focal point for some strong to severe storms. Again, that stays south of the UP, but if you are in Wisconsin, if you are in areas downstate today, please keep an eye on the radar and an eye to the sky. There could be some strong to severe storms. We have high pressure north of the UP that's going to sink in out of Canada. That's going to allow clouds to clear out for tomorrow. So we'll have some sunshine as we head towards Tuesday and Wednesday. But in the meantime, though, we're hanging on to some clouds and a few light spotty rain showers kind of exiting off of the southeast off of Delta County and moving offshore over Lake Michigan this morning. Here's how it looks. We'll put this into motion for you. We'll bump up some clouds today. Most of the day is dry. This is the high resolution model, which is bringing in just a little bit of light rain showers along the Wisconsin state line for this evening, maybe even potentially into the central areas of the UP for tonight early tonight that is again most of this rain is staying south of the UP and then tomorrow we're looking at some sunshine developing with some north and northeasterly winds so a little bit more breezy for tomorrow but today going to be a comfortable one low 70s in the north with mid 70s across the southern counties of the UP our overnight lows in the 50s ranging even some upper 40s along the Wisconsin state line and then tomorrow some similar temperature ranges for our highs lower 70s in the north with mid 70s across the south here's a look at your extended forecast. So Tuesday and Wednesday, not bad. There might be a potential for a few overnight showers Wednesday night into Thursday, but Thursday into Friday, this system's going to move in. This one has a better probability of bringing in some of those rain showers as well as some thunderstorms throughout the course of Thursday afternoon, extending into this upcoming Friday. For now,